I am so tired, but I have to make this video. Disclaimer, I am not a hair expert. I'm just a girl who wants to experiment with hair remedies. So if this doesn't turn out perfect, or if you try it and it's itchy and all that stuff, don't blame me. Just do your own research before you try this out. the day first peter 5 verse 7 cast all your anxiety on him because he cares for you hey beautiful welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new to this channel hi my name is Moaba, and i'm here to chit chat with you if you're a tenant subscriber thank you so much for coming back welcome to another all things hair video as you can see from the title of this video we're going to be making an aloe mask and then twisting my hair and then trimming my hair so that's going to be eventful so i'm just going to briefly mention some of the benefits of using aloe vera on your hair so one of them is that it promotes growth it fights dandruff and hair fall another thing is that it conditions your hair and makes it softer and smoother as well as adding moisture it enhances the growth of new hair follicles so that's a good thing right um i'm pretty sure you could get more and better results if you use it consistently but I'm just out here trying to experiment with different hair masks and different hair remedies. But the one that I've been um, mostly consistent with is the rice water remedy. And I still think it's a good remedy because it works for me. But this time I just wanted to try something different because I've done rice water remedies, I think maybe three times on this channel already. So why not try out new stuff? So yeah, if you enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up, come back for more videos and make sure to share this video Turn on that notification bell so you know every single time I upload a video and make sure to subscribe. Subscribe and tell your friends to subscribe as well so this family can grow. That's about it. So let's go make that hair mask. Hey guys, so this is everything. This is the aloe vera that I have and I have a knife, chopping board, a spoon. Um, this is a masher, but you can use um, a blender or just use your hands. And then I have these two bowls that I'm going to use as well. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, now that I've cut the sides, I'm going to just chop this up and then scrape off the gel that's inside. We have a problem number one the aloe vera is not very chunky so i don't have like you know a, like a lot of gel that has come out of it number two um i put the aloe vera in the fridge and it's been there for quite some time so i think that made it very watery so it's no longer sticky so instead of making a gel i think i'm just going to like juice it up so i'm going to put the whatever i managed to collect from the aloe vera into a blender just blend the whole thing this is what we're dealing with it's not a lot but um i mean it is what it is <laughs> we learn from our mistakes and now i know that i'm just going to use fresh aloe next time i want to make an aloe mask so i'm just going to put this in the blender right now So this is our aloe juice. I'm ready to go and put it in my hair now. Okay, you guys, so I just finished making my juice. Um, I just showed it to you. And now I'm going to just replace my water with the juice so I, I can easily just spray it into my hair, work it through my hair, and then cover it up with a bag 
for um maybe 30 minutes i don't have a shower cap so i'm just gonna use a plastic bag okay <laughs> we are all about budgets on this channel i'm pretty sure you know that right first of all the aloe vera is just from outside and many people have it readily available to them other people buy it from stores and i think the one that people buy from stores is like the really chunky one i don't know where to find it but please comment down below if you know where i can find this aloe vera like the chunky aloe vera i will be very very grateful um so let me just quickly replace this water with the aloe juice and then we can spray it into my hair and continue with this video I have my aloe juice right here um <laughs> I don't know why mine looks like this, but I think maybe because I still had some of the green particles on it. Um, it's just the first time I'm trying this out, so yeah. I'm ready to get this started. <laughs> I know, I know, I know I look a little bit crazy, but it's okay. Um, This is what my hair looks like. I know the back and the front are so, so different, but yeah, I just undid the twists of the previous hairstyle that I did. So I think I'm going to split my hair into two sections. So step number one, you might need a towel or a t-shirt. So let's begin. It's so windy outside, so I'm pretty, I'm really sorry for the sound. Because I feel like you guys can hear it really, really loudly. But yeah. So what I'm doing is just spraying it on the hair and then working it in. I'm pretty sure it's more ideal to do, um, to work with this in smaller sections, but looking at the time i don't feel like it you know so i'm just going in like this i don't know why this just stopped working so i think i'm going to finish this off in the bathroom i'll just pour it into my hair over the sink so disappointing Okay, so I managed to put the juice in my hair and now I'm just about to put the plastic bag. Now that the bag is on my head, I am just going to keep it on for 30 minutes. I'm just sitting in the sun and it feels so good because it feels like I'm steaming my hair and it's cooking and all that stuff. And guys, it's actually not itchy, so I don't know. I expected it to be itchy because most of the times when I've used aloe on my face, it becomes itchy before it dries but that didn't happen i'm starting to think maybe it's because i kept it in the fridge but anyways i am just going to be in my natural dryer <laughs> and see you in 30 minutes okay you guys um it's 30 minutes later actually i'm lying it's an hour later <laughs> wow so now i'm just going to hop into the shower rinse all of this out condition my hair and then we can come and do the twists and trim it I'm nice and clean I feel so refreshed so now we can start with the twists I'm just going to be using um, my two moisturizers which I recently got and this is the mango and marula curl care moisturizing live-in butter and then this one is the oil moisturizer um, with avocado oil so now I know there's always that whole thing of um, don't use oils in your hair. Don't use this in your hair <sighs> It becomes very tricky for you to know what you can use and what you can't use so I've just told myself that I will Just buy whatever it is. I want to buy and just work with it because everyone's hair is different Everyone's hair grows different. Everyone's hair is different
Okay, you guys, I'm done with this section. So now I'm going to do this other side in one, two, three. So I'm done. This is what the hair is looking like right now. I'm just going to add castor oil in my edges because look at this. I have really, really short hair in the sides and it's just on this part and on this part. So I'm just putting the castor oil in the sides just like that and just brush with my edge brush. Yeah, so those are the ends that I just trimmed off and I'm happy. My next trim is going to be in about six weeks. Okay, you guys, we have come to the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and leave a beautiful comment down below. Actually, comment down below if there are any remedies or recipes that you've always wanted to try or that you actually use so that I can also try them out. We're here to encourage each other to love our crowns and to keep them healthy and flourishing and looking good and all that stuff. Health over length. Make sure to come back and watch more videos so you can get to know how to look cute on a budget and take care of your hair and grow your hair, all that good stuff. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next one. Bye. Mwah. If you're not following me on Instagram, make sure to do so at mcm underscore muya and come back for more videos. Okay, bye. For real this time.